baseball hit home runs as frequently as Ralph Kiner. Now, many predicted that the Pittsburgh Pirates slugger would be capable of smashing Babe Ruth's single-season home run mark of 60. Ralph, did you ever think you could do it? It was uh, definitely a concern, and uh, there were many articles that were written about I was the heir apparent to break the 60 home runs of Babe Ruth. Uh, I never really got to that point. The best I ever did was 54 home runs, but uh, I wasn't uh, close enough at the end of the season to really make that a consideration. That contract squabble he had with Branch Rickey. In 1952, I led the league at home runs, tied with Hank Sauer with 37 home runs. And uh, that year, Ranch Rickey came in and took over the ball club. He had been with the Dodgers and, of course, prior to that, the St. Louis ball club. And he was not known for uh, paying baseball players any amount of money. So he sent me a contract that was uh, an offer of 25% less than I was making. I uh, met with Branch Rickey, and uh, I kept arguing my point that we... And I hit 37 home runs. I led the National League at home runs, led the major leagues in home runs, tied with Hank Sauer. And Mr. Ricky finally said to me, he said, uh, Lord, we finished. And I said, well, we finished last. He says, we can finish last without you. So that was the message right there. I signed, took my 25% cut, and went to spring training. Well, hi, everybody. I'm Ralph Kiner, along with Tim McGarver and Steve Sabrisky, and the Mets with a magic number of one. And they can control their own destiny. All they have to do to be the champions of the National League East is win here tonight. It makes no difference what the Phillies do if they do win. And I think that your wife, Ann McCarver, put it best. It's a lot like being pregnant, she said. <laughs> you know it's going to come. The event will take place, but you're going to experience some pain with it. And the Mets have had some pain because they could have clinched it way back when on Friday with Dwight Gooden on the mound. Now Dwight with a second chance. Kiner's Corner is brought to you by the good Olds guys who invite you to see the Oldsmobile Cutlass Supreme and other 1983 automobiles today. Well, hi everybody. I'm Ralph Kiner and we have as our special guest Tom Seaver. And it was a fitting day for two great pitchers and Tom Seaver, of course, started the ball game for the Mets and... Tom, I think one of the greatest things that I saw was the ovation you got as you came in from the bullpen to start that ball game. Well, we're talking with Keith Hernandez and the passing of the great Ralph Kiner. Keith, you, you talked about Kiner's Corner. Um, what was that like? What was it like to get asked to go on and then in that atmosphere? What was it about Ralph that had a way to make players feel so comfortable? Well, Ralph was just uh, a character, and, you know, he was very sociable, and, um, uh, it was a big deal going on in Kiner's Corner. Back in those days, in the 70s, uh, uh, which I can speak to, there wasn't a post-game show in a studio at a ballpark. There was this, it was the only one, and you figured, gosh, we're in New York, and this is a big deal, even though when that was going on, the Mets were not doing so grand uh, in the mid to late 70s. It was a big deal to go on there. Plus... He always gave you that hundred dollar bill. And you're on the road, so he always able to take the guys out for for dinner or, or for a few drinks. It's quite an honor, of course, to be here. In fact, it's an honor to be anywhere at my age. But the, in the words of the immortal humorist and great friend of mine, Phil Harris, if I'd known I was going to live this long. I would have taken better care of myself. He was the type of player that uh, exerted baseball, and I think that's what uh, we all should appreciate, having the chance to play a game uh, like baseball that uh, is such a superb game and tactical and what have you, if you understand it. And uh, I think the majority of people in the United States do understand it.